Okay, so good morning, David. I just wanted to run through with you actually the CMA. Um, so I've, I made this right here for you. So this is your property right here that we're looking at. So we're going to try to compare it to a few other ones. So let's take a look here. I found some really good comps. Um, so if you look here, this is your subject line right here. This is us. The rest of these are going to be quite similar. This is 3,900 square feet. Um, this property is a little larger, uh, but I'm going to run through with you some of the ups and downs of some of these properties. So let's take a look here. This one actually doesn't have the square footage, but it's actually 138 Ravenwood is, um, is actually 3,100 square feet. However, it has a full finished basement, so it's close to 4,000 square feet. So let's continue going down. So these are a total of four. These are all that closed. Obviously, I didn't show you any of the active one of the active competition, which I could show you at a different time, but I just wanted to show you what realistically sells at what price. So here is line by line. If you take a quick look over here, um, you have this one, 705 Breakneck Hill Road. That's on the same um, that's on the on the same block as you. So this one actually just sold March 7th of 2019, which is really recent. And it sold for a price of five ninety nine, which is a really nice price. Sorry, sold price for five eighty, listed at five ninety nine. Um, that's one forty nine per square foot. Um, so, and here is the other things that we're looking for. The acreage on this one is extra two acres. About um, it's a couple of years older, but it does have four hundred square feet uh, more than yours. I um, mean, again, like I said, this one has a full finished basement as well. Two fireplaces. Again, the attached garage is very similar to yours. Taxes are a little higher, but I would say this is a pretty similar house as well. Let's go to 624 Watertown Road. Um, so this one is a pretty much no frills house, I would call it. It sold for 411, as you can see right here, um, on February 1st, 2019. So again, it's pretty recent. Also 1995, pretty close. And again, the square footage on this one is 39.68, which is obviously a little more, like about 500 square feet more than what you have. Um, it does have two full bathrooms as opposed to you. You had three full bathrooms, so this is also a pretty good comp. Here are two more that we're going to line up. 42 Falcon. Again, it's pretty much a no-frills house. Um, it, what you see is what you get. Built in 92, 3,100 square feet, two full bathrooms. So this is also pretty good, and you can see sold price per square foot is 131 on here. Uh, so this one, for some reason, I'm not sure it didn't come up on here, but this was uh, next one over is 138 Ravenwood Drive. This one was sold for 459. The square footage um, on this one was 3100. But again, like I mentioned earlier to you, that it does have a full finished basement, which adds a lot of value as well. I could send you the pictures to those if you want. Um, so this is the analytics of the general 411 to 599. Um, that's the ups and the downs, tops and bottoms. If you scroll through here, you'll see the graphs of different things that it goes through. Sold price as to um, as the listed price. And if you have any questions on this, please let me know. I'd be more than glad to help you. Um, here, here, is, here is the listing, uh, the stuff that they wrote, the comments in each, in each of the listings. You can read through them, which will give you some details on the uh, features of each house just to, to give you more of an idea of how to comp that through. And if you scroll through the bottom, it just goes on and shows you the numbers, the highs and the lows, um, the days on the market right here, the sale price versus the listing price was a 96% to listing price. You can see here that most of these actually got 96%, 95 to 96%. So obviously they were priced pretty fair as well. Some were better construction, some were like McMansions, cookie cutters, uh, just very simple, no frills. And again, like I said, if you have any questions on this, I'm gonna send this to you an attachment. I'm also gonna send you this video, obviously, because you can't watch it. For some reason, it doesn't have um, it doesn't have your property here. I don't know why either. But Breaking a Kill Road is right here. So this is you, and these are a little more on the outskirts. All right, thanks for watching. Have a good one.